Okay, so we're here with Casey Bellamy, defenseman from the white team after the national team scrimmage here at UNE. Casey, can you just talk for a few minutes about the atmosphere of the scrimmage and how you think things went tonight? Yeah, it was great. I think uh, the first scrimmage, you know, it was a little uh, rough to get our feet under us. Um, it was the first scrimmage we had, um, definitely for the post-grads in a long time, I think since uh, February. But um, the other girls in the other 22 team, they were together a couple weeks ago. But um, I think today we really picked it up and moved the puck fast, played really good defense, and, um, you know, Team Moy, I think, played well, and uh, I think it's been a great camp so far. Perfect. And uh, what is it that you like most about camps like this, and are you looking forward to getting back on the ice again tomorrow? Uh, definitely, you know, the atmosphere, um, the competition, playing against each other. It's always a tryout when we get on the ice. Um, you know, best players in, you know, America competing against each other. And obviously representing our country every time we put on that USA jersey, it's, you know, an honor. So I think we really try and take pride in that. And, you know, you just try and showcase yourself to the best ability on and off the ice. Sure, sure. Have you, uh, is this your first time to Maine? Uh, nope, been here a couple of times. My brother went to the University of Maine and um, been to Kenny Bunkport a lot, uh, Wells Beach. But uh, we also had a camp a few falls ago um, at a college up here. Perfect. Well, thanks for taking the time to do the interview. Absolutely. We Thank enjoy you. having you here at UNE. Thank you. Right, can you talk a little bit about the atmosphere of the scrimmage and how you think things went? Uh, it was pretty good. The atmosphere is awesome. Um, with all the fans in the stands, uh, kind of makes the game a little more lively. And obviously, again, playing against uh, the top girls in the country, the uh, speed of the game is really quick, and everything happens really quickly. So. I think this is a good camp to kind of like help me progress um, a little further and uh, obviously having a uh, teammate or alignment like Decker and Annie Pankowski kind of make me look a little better out there. So, so that's a good segue into our next question. Um, your, your line seemed to have a pretty good jump tonight. If you can just talk about the challenges when you're paired up with, with folks that maybe you haven't played with before and uh, the short, you know, short turnaround to build chemistry with your line mates. Uh, at a camp like this, uh, with all the top girls in the country, it's a lot easier. Uh, you just kind of go out there and play the game like you know how, and things kind of come together. Uh, like Obviously, like I said before, having Decker as a center is awesome. She's a great player, and Annie Pankowski on the wing, and just all the girls. It's a lot easier to come together when you have people with uh, such high skill level. Sure. Uh, you've been a member of the U22 team and have had some success at that level. Obviously, you're looking to take the next step. Uh, just talk a little bit about this event and how that hopefully factors into to that progress. Uh, just like being around the Olympians and a lot of the older girls, kind of seeing the things they do before and after games, like on the ice, uh, staying late after practice, doing all that stuff, and even just playing against them and learning from them, I think is a huge takeaway for me from this camp. Just kind of learning from them and hopefully applying it to my game and hopefully that will help me progress. Perfect. Just uh, last question for you. Is this your first time to this area in Maine specifically? Uh, yes, this is my first time to Maine. It's awesome. Uh, even just driving over the river and seeing everything is awesome. The atmosphere in here with all the fans that they've gotten to come here from uh, advertising and everything is awesome. Well, thanks again, Cameron, for taking the time to do the interview, and best of luck. Thank you.